What's good, YouTube? You know who it is. Chris Jones, represent for Six of Greatness. And you know what time it is, guys. It's another episode of Cooking with Chris. So here we are, man. Um, first and foremost, let me say, it's been a while since I've done a cooking episode. And I'm going to try to get back to the roots. Get back to what made for Zeke's of Greatness a great, unique channel. I'm going to start back cooking more often. I've just been pretty busy lately, man. Real talk. But I'm going to get back to my roots, man. Back to the way things used to be, man. More eating out, pigging ass. More cooking with Chris's, man. But let me tell you this, man. This is a great meal for bulking or cutting. Depending on the size you choose. I'm bulking, so I'm going with some carbs, baby. And uh, you can also get chicks when you cook healthy meals. Go to the, go to the gym. And walk up to one of them cardio bunnies and you'd be like, hey baby, let me cook you a healthy meal. I promise you, man, you will seal the fucking deal. Women love a guy that can cook, especially a healthy meal. But anyway, here it goes, man. This is real simple. This is probably going to be one of the quickest Cooking with Chris episodes you've ever seen. So here it goes. First, you're going to need some turkey. Pretty hard to make turkey meatloaf without fucking turkey. You can choose the 9010. 8515. I like to keep my meats lean. I went with the 93.7. You know what I mean? The camera can see that. 93.7. All you gotta do is dump it in your bowl. Ugh. All right. Make sure you get all of it. I paid for all of it. I want all of it, right? So I got that emptied out. Same thing. Empty that out. All right. So I got two pounds of meat. You know what, before I start, let me go ahead and uh, take this hoodie off, man. I don't want to get my hoodie dirty, man. This is white. If it was black, I wouldn't mind. And if you're wondering about the hoodies, you know, they will be out soon. I'm talking to the people at Rescue Tour. Hopefully they come out with them. They don't want to make a whole bunch of fucking hoodies if ain't nobody going to fucking buy them. You got to respect that. You know what I mean? So I'm, I'm working on it, guys. You know what I mean? And if you want to buy some POG apparel, go to the uh, stores. The links is in the description. We got two stores, a spread shirt store and a respiratory store. Damn, I'm getting swole. Fuck. But anyway, <laughs> hey, who you am I getting swole? Yeah. All right, yeah, that's my All right, look. And fat, too. Hey, hey, man. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I got two pounds of meat. And this shit right here is on point. This is called tomato sauce, right? And it's already seasoning. It's seasoned purposely for meatloaf. It has like garlic powder, you know, salt, pepper, onion, thyme, you know, all kinds of seasonings that you would typically use for meatloaf, you know, but it already has it built in. You can get this at Walmart and at Albertsons and at Kroger. It's called Hunt's Meatloaf Tomato Sauce off the fucking hook. So I put it in here, put the whole thing. No, I put half of it in here, just half, because once it, once it gets cooked, you're gonna pour the other half on top. All right, so pour half the meatloaf on here. I mean, half the sauce on top of the meat. And then, I got a half a cup. No, right here, you see this? I got a whole cup of oatmeal. So one cup of oatmeal. I'm gonna put the text on the screen, okay? So you won't get confused. One cup of oatmeal, a half a can of tomato paste, all right? Put that in here. All right. And I like onions. This is purely preference, like my boy Lean Body Lifestyle would say. Purely just personal preference. All right. I just put some onions in here. I'm gonna go ahead and throw some onions in here. Kind of love onions. All right. And we need two whole eggs. All right. So here we go. Crack. Bam. A good idea when you crack your eggs, you might want to put them in here. Because sometimes, man, once in a blue moon, you'll get a bloody egg. It happens, trust me. So put it in here, then pour it on top. Alright, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna use your hands and you're gonna pretty much mold everything together. Once I mold everything together, we'll be right back. 
guys. We've got the washer in my hands. As you see, everything is molded together nice and thoroughly. Everything's blended nice and nice, nice and tight. All right. What we're going to do now is mold it into a nice little loaf. All right. Got me a pan. Hey, man, if you want to save time on dishes, get you some fucking foil. Line it up. Clean it up after yourself after cooking is a bitch. One of the reasons why I hate cooking. Uh, let's bread with a little Pam. You never know, just in case. It keeps it. Uh, people overseas don't know what the fuck this is. It's crazy, man. People overseas don't have half the shit we have in America. But this is called Pam spray. Just to make sure it's, shit don't stick. You know what I mean? Let's pour it in here. All right. Mold it to a nice little loaf. All right. Check me out. Check your boy out. Look at that. Just hit it on the sides. You know what I mean? Hit it on the sides. See it in here? That's all you gotta do. I got a little egg right here. Should have blended up a little better. Hold up. Uh, you guys gotta. Uh, just gotta. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It's all good. There you go. Almost there. Let's move on top. Hey, don't be scared to get a little messy with it, man. You're gonna, you're gonna get your hand. Hey, put the camera in the camera, man. You're gonna get low. You're gonna get your hands nasty. Don't be in this bitch. You know, try and, uh, hey man, get down and dirty with the meatloaf, man. All right? Don't be scared of the meat, man. No homo. Don't be scared of the meat, though, man. <laughs> Real talk. Get up in there. There it is. I got my shit looking pretty. See that? Nice and pretty. I got the oven already preheated at 400, all right? We're going to put this bitch in for one hour. I'll see you guys in one hour. Oh, fuck that! We gotta fast forward this bitch! Flip it, man! Man, it's been a while since I've done this shit. Hold on, man. Hold on. You ready? <laughs> Bam! Woo! There it is, alright. It's been one hour. That was the quickest hour I've ever had in my life. Alright. Uh, here we go. Let's see what we got going on here. Yeah. As you can see, the meat is done. Maybe a little too done a little bit, but it's done. Now, you get the other half of your sauce, pour it on top. Make sure you pour it on evenly on top. And there you have it, guys. A nice meatloaf. Now let that shit sit for about five minutes. Let the sauce thicken. You know, the heat of the meatloaf is going to thicken the sauce a bit. So let that shit sit for about five to ten minutes. Now, let's discuss sides, man. Now, if you're dieting or cutting, you know, or bulking or whatever, or maintaining, then you're going to have to choose your sides according to your macronutrient and calorie needs. All right? Me personally, if I was cutting, I'll probably go with a salad and maybe one cup of brown rice or some shit like that. But since I'm bulking and pretty much not counting the damn thing, I'm trying to get as big as possible. This is what I'm fucking with right here. Let me show you what I got. Oh, before I start, it won't be cooking with Chris without my girl's spatula. <laughs> <laughs> here we are, the infamous ghetto spatula. Let me show you what I got, man. I made some mashed potatoes. Uh, with real potatoes, not that instant shit. I chopped them down, boiled them, seasoned them up, put some uh, olive oil. I didn't use butter. You can if you want to, though. Use olive oil, salt, and pepper. Made some cornbread. This is the brand cornbread I like to use. I use this instant cornbread shit right here. Real good. By Martha White, you know what I mean? Sweet cornbread. What you know about that? Y'all know about that shit. So I give me some cornbread. <laughs> give me two of these bitches, man. Ugh. 
two pieces of good cornbread. Mmm. 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 <laughs> yeah. Some potatoes. Get as much as I want. You know, as much as I can fit in my mouth. I I F Y M. If it fits your mouth. Start my own shit. Shout out to Tyrone Jackson on Facebook. Cool guy. You know what I mean? Here we go. Bam. And now, I'm going to have me a little meatloaf, man. This is two pounds of meatloaf. Me, typically, since I usually eat alone, you know, I got I got a guest today, but I usually eat alone, I split it up in four pieces. You know what I mean? I have me like an eight-ounce piece. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, get as much as I want. Bam. And there you have it, guys. That's my bulking dinner. This is turkey meatloaf. Make sure when you try it, you let me know how you liked it. And uh, before you go, don't forget to like my shit, comment, subscribe, holler back at your boy. Trying to get my job